Wow. At NASA, we are more than just a team. We are a family. To share some words of wisdom with you, we have three astronauts here with us today who sat in this very stage some years ago and received their astronaut pins. Please welcome NASA astronauts Chris Birch, Nicole Ayers, and Chris Williams. Lauren, Yuri, Becky, Adam, Cameron, Aaron, Kate, Ben, Mel, and Anna. Congratulations and welcome to the team. My name is Chris Birch, and I am a member of the 2021 NASA astronaut class. I'm here with two of my fly classmates, so this is officially a swarm. <laughs> Your astronaut class is a very special group. That's why there's a tradition among astronauts that the newest astronaut class is named by the class before it. Our class was named by the turtles, who lovingly gave us the name the flies, because among more humorous reasons, they hoped we would fly early, and indeed we have. Nicole just returned from her five-month mission aboard the International Space Station, and Chris is preparing to launch for his eight-month mission this November. The bonds form with your class. <laughs> the bonds formed with your class are very special. Astronaut training is an apprenticeship. We learn from our trainers and our instructors, and we are constantly learning from each other. Your training builds a foundation of trust that will carry you throughout your career and on to your future missions. On behalf of all the flies, we look forward to getting to know your class so we can give you a name befitting your personalities and appropriate for the exciting and dynamic time that we are in in human spaceflight. As Chris mentioned, your next few years are going to be all about learning and training. In many ways, it's like drinking from a fire hose. They'll be asked to learn, not just learn, but to master new skills and disciplines. Some of these might be familiar to some members of your class, like flying an aircraft or characterizing crystals in a rock. But others are going to be totally new to you. I know for me in my class, it was a, an incredible experience uh, the first time we were underwater in a spacesuit under 40 feet of water in our neutral buoyancy lab practicing uh, a spacewalk to repair a space station. That was totally new and just an awesome experience. Thankfully, you're going to have some of the most talented and passionate instructors and an incredibly dedicated team here at NASA who are going to help you through this. We could not do what we do without the amazing support that we have here at the Johnson Space Center and from the entire NASA community. But some of the most special moments will come as you find how much you get to learn from each other, from your classmates, your peers. It's really a rare opportunity to be surrounded by a group of individuals that all come from different backgrounds, different fields, and with different experiences, but who are at the highest levels of their professions. When I have a question about the nuances of flying a T-38 in formation, 